everyone welcome to another important video on sql interview question so in this video we are going to answer the difference between count star count one and count of a specific column and we'll observe the difference here again this is being frequently asked so let us start so to answer this question i'm going to take our employee table as a standard example and i'm just going to run the command to see what we got here So this is the data we have now let us see how many number of records we got here so simply we can write select count of star to get the total count of this table or to know how many records do we have in this table so 14 records we got here so even if i give like say select count of one from emp the results would not change much. Again, here, like you know, uh, some people you know believe that you know count one is faster or count star is faster. But technically speaking, I believe uh, you know the execution plan at the back end for both of them is very similar. We can use you know whatever we feel is good for our use case now let us run uh, the command here again like select the star from emp now if you observe this job column here okay so we are going to run a command on this so there is you know sales manager analyst manager and all so now let us observe the difference here select count of if i give this job as the column name from employee then let us see the difference now it is giving me 14 only but again i can here i can specify to get distinct rows okay so there are five distinct jobs in our employee table so we can use it like way okay so i mean this is very important question with respect to interview and I hope you find this video you know, useful and, and I hope you answer this question in the interview. So if you like it, please like, share and subscribe. Have a good day. Bye-bye.